I just love the fact that you're cooking in Z-Man. Z-Man stuff. And I'm cooking salmon. It's not bad. Fish? But, in yeah. fishing gear. It's going to make it taste better. What's it going to taste like, though? Lemon pepper flavor. Lemon My pepper. My specialty. Salmon. Yes. Wild rice. Broccoli. Broccoli. And I got some asparagus. No, it'll probably just be eaten by mom because they have to eat it. What do you think? You like it? Yes. Alright, get out of here. couple new boxes from Carl's Mystery Taco Box. If you guys haven't shopped at carls.com, check it out. <clears throat> I got a whole new box here. So Toho is the second FLW Tour event and I'm excited about that, number one, because it's booty butt naked cold outside right now, right? Second thing is I'm doing another straight up fishing episode in Florida. You've seen the one now. Bama. We're going to start fishing a little bit more offshore, a little deeper, going down to a little bit clearer water. Doing a little bit more target oriented fishing so there's, since there's not as much current, the fish are not going to be out being aggressive. We did one in Charleston. Yeah, yeah, this this time so. of year in November, every oh, day is yeah. different, but uh, it's a good time of year. 120 max. At 120, we're cutting it off. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. Be loud, let's go. Oh, God. Drip some more, Drag. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Take some more. I did one in here at home that it's going to come out. Just give me some time here. I've been doing a lot, but. We got one here at home that's come out that you definitely want to see. Now I'm about to do the fourth one in Florida. So what I got here is a whole new box of tackle to use down in Florida. <clears throat> so let's open up this and see exactly what I got in here. Can't wait to use all this stuff in Florida. Oh God, look at this. I got some uh, got a rattle bait, got some rattle baits. Punch skirts. So it's like a top water, top water lure here. All kind of soft plastics. A whole bunch of stuff in here. Look, there's really like there's too much to go through. A lot of soft plastics in here. So make sure you guys do a couple things. Here's here's the thing. So I'm gonna do a straight up fishing episode in Florida using all the baits that are in these boxes, right? The other thing is I've been doing some videos for Mystery Tackle Box that you can check out on the Mystery Tackle Box um, YouTube channel. Plenty to try to catch a fish with, so now all we can do is get out here, put some of these baits in our hand, and see exactly what we can catch. I'll leave a link right here. I've done some on cranking. I've done some on um, fishing in cold weather. I've done some on selecting the right baits for different situations. There's a bunch of different videos on Mystery Tackle Boxes YouTube channel that you can see me fish and break down different baits in different types of water, etc., etc. So I also ordered some more baits, and these are. If you've been watching my videos recently, you notice I've been doing a lot of fishing with jigging spoons. trouble getting in touch with the right people to make the jigging spoons that I like to use so I've been using I've been actually buying store-bought jigging spoons recently so it's just not the same as my old handmade ones they look good there is a lavender pink I got some half ounce and some 716 got a bunch of different sizes but it's still not 
Just not my homemade spoon, man. I mentioned that we did another straight up fishing episode here in South Carolina on my home lake at Hartwell. And I haven't put all the pieces together on that particular video yet, but I I can't help. I got to try to show you a little bit of what happens. This is it's an exciting day. Probably this has been, I'm telling you, this has been the best straight up fishing episode that I have done so far. So I'm just going to show you just that much of what happened. That's just a little teaser here. Oh, man, you got down there? There's a bunch of them. That's what I'm talking about! Let's see, he's got a couple more here. Yeah, it was definitely raining. This is this is a little bit of what it rained the entire day that we shot that episode. There's a little bit of what happened there. Okay, so this this right here. This right here. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That happened. This particular episode, just like myself in November. Jacob had another baby, so he wasn't able to be there for this particular one. Still going to do a lot of the stuff for me, but for this one, he was busy having babies. So we had a stand-in, and I'm pretty sure if you follow bass fishing, any at all, that you'll notice this guy. So let me, let me show you who was helping me. There he is. That, that, that's him. That's the guy. That's who stood in for me. The Ronnie Moore. The Bassmaster, excuse my slow internet, I'm sorry about that. That's the problems with living in the country, that you don't really have internet. But Ronnie Moore, the guy with the circle on his chin, that's who did, who stepped in and did the camera work for me. So thanks to Ronnie Moore for standing in for Jacob while he was making babies. He's not making babies, he's kind of like having babies. Dude. I'm still watching this weather. Look, guys. I'm telling you that that right there is love in the me. That excites me. I, I can think of so many so many reasons why I think this is gonna be a great tournament. I am I dude, I can't wait to get started. So if you're next week, the tournament starts on next Thursday. I'm not sure what the date is on that, but you can go to FLW Fishing dot com and figure out everything you need to know about how to get there when to get there and what time but if you're going to to be there make sure you guys stop by and wait and let's hang out and talk at toho let's chop it up after the weigh-in i usually hang around the way in a couple hours just to uh just kind of hang out and get to talk to some of you guys that watch my channel and and uh, follow me on instagram and facebook and so forth so Make sure you're there. I'm looking forward to meeting you. Don't be late. Yeah.